confirmed cases of leptospirosis in Pima County, the most recent from a dog that frequently visited Udall Park. Health officials are recommending dog owners avoid that park if their dogs have not been vaccinated against lepto. Nine on your side's Priscilla Casper spoke with dog owners about their thoughts on this deadly disease. Another confirmed case of leptospirosis in Pima County from a dog that frequently visited Udall Park. Lepto is a disease spread through urine and contaminated water and can affect animals and people. Dr. Jen Wilcox with Pima Animal Care Center says health officials are on high alert. I've heard that there are many big communal buckets of water and that often dogs will cruise by and urinate on them. That's the perfect way to infect an entire big group of happy, healthy, socialized dogs with with leptospirosis. You gonna catch it? Catch it. Good catch. Aubrey Vosberg takes her dog Ellie to Udall Park every day, and she says she's not worried. I know it's been going around Tucson, but I don't know. It's, I don't think it's gonna be too big of a deal. Tia Cookinmaster says she's very concerned. And I've noticed that a lot of dogs have been kind of, there's not as been as many dogs at the dog park because I think a lot of people are concerned about it or worried that maybe other people's dogs aren't vaccinated. <laughs> Some signs that your dog has lepto, drinking or urinating more than usual, redness in the eyes, depression, reluctant to eat or has a high fever. We're investing in some quick tests that aren't perfect, but at least would give us some screening um, capabilities and we're probably going to start vaccinating at least some subset of our population. Vaccines can range from $25 to $30. Priscilla Casper, KGA9 on your side.